Good morning. It is a cold and dark Thursday morning, and I am in the warmest room in the house, my boys' room, hence the decor. <laughs> I hope that you are waking up feeling ready to start your day. It is Christmas season 2017, and for many of us, this does not bring merriment and cheer these dark days and the, the cold weather and just the hustle and bustle of preparing for the Christmas season. And sometimes for, for many of us, it causes us to get run down. Our stress is compounded. You get sick or a little depressed. And so I just had a few thoughts for you today on how to kind of ward off that the winter blues during the Christmas season. So the first thing I had in mind was to schedule me time. This is a super busy season and full of family and friends, which is great, but also you need your alone time. You need your downtime. So that will have to be scheduled. Otherwise, the other scheduling will just run right over you. Plan a time for yourself whatever it be, if you need a nap, if you need to just sit down and read your book quietly, if you need time for prayer or meditation, if you need time to work out, whatever it is, make sure that that gets in the calendar. The second thing is to drink plenty of fluids. I've found that I am drinking way more coffee now that it's cold outside and am finding also that that is counterproductive to staying healthy, having energy actually, if you drink caffeine, then you're um, going to be amping up that anxiety. If you're struggling with that already, it influences your sleep. It affects your sleep. And so you won't be sleeping as well, which I have also discovered for myself. So drink plenty of water, plenty of fluids, and then get some good rest. And those are things that help us all year round. And third, be intentional about spending time with those who actually make you feel cheery. If there are certain people in your life who make you laugh, people you enjoy being around, it's just easy to be with them, then be intentional about spending more time with them. These good friends probably will be happy to spend that time because chances are you make them feel bright too. And those are just a few ways to make your holiday season more merry and bright. Have a beautiful week, and I'll see you back here next Thursday for Thursday Thrive in 3.